right. Todd is back with your full forecast. Happy Friday. Thanks. Friends. Yeah, you too. Have, you, have you cooled down? Yeah. You know I, what? I'm not glistening as much as I was when it, we first I started. Mean, so it, it, <laughs> the temperature was pretty high in here today. I don't know. It's, I don't know why, but it's a weird thing. Weird thing. Mm -hmm. But today's going to be a nice one, huh? Gorgeous. Yeah. Outdoor weather will be like perfect. Ooh, you know, I not too it. warm, not too cold, just right. Oh, I love it. <laughs> Goldilocks like would love it too. Perfect. <laughs> uh, let's get started. There's actually kind of a lot to talk about. Well, first of all, we do have some patchy dense fog in our mountain valleys where it's getting really chilly and some spots dipping down into the 30s. There are a lot of 40s on the map again this morning. Portland's 51 though. Lewiston is 47. Augusta's 51. The chillier spots are in the foothill and mountain locations. We go to eastern Maine. Almost everyone here is in the 40s, except for a few in the 30s this morning. Holton, Presque Isle, and Escort Station, 37 de chilly degrees. That high is draped right over us, so we get ourselves another gorgeous day. And then our attention turns to this right here. This is a pretty strong developing storm and may actually become tropical with its characteristics. Bring some windswept rain to the Outer Banks, to the Mid-Atlantic and up through southern New England and perhaps give us a couple of showers over our weekend and we'll chat about that in a second. Your morning clear and quiet with that chilly start. Definitely a light jacket or a fleece would do it. Patchy fog and a lot of dew on the grass as well. Statewide sunshine middle of the day. Very pleasant temperatures 60s to around 70. This afternoon will be bright and beautiful. There'll be some high clouds coming in, so I think that's going to give us some super sweet colors at sunset. It will be crisp, though, with a breeze coming in off the water, so that feel of fall will be with us as that sun angle gets lower, deeper into the day and into the evening. Here are your temperatures, 60s for the coast, Bar Harbor 65, Portland 67, and then right around 70 everywhere else. Augusta, Lewiston, Bangor, Waterville, Callis, 71 Millinocket, 71 Freiburg, Berlin, New Hampshire. That is about as high as we'll get today, but again, that's almost perfect. High pressure will give way to this developing storm system. So tomorrow as it weekends, the clouds will increase and then this thing will swing by to our south. It's really not going to get all the way up into northern New England, but it may give us a couple of showers late tomorrow in the evening or again on Sunday and then also on Monday as it starts to shift out of here. Behind it, high pressure will build in again and a lot of the middle part of next week and second half of next week look beautiful as well. So here we go with our tropical system or a potentially tropical system. It's not named yet, but it could be Ophelia at some point today, and it should make a landfall in North Carolina and then spin up the coastline as it weakens and shift south of us. With that said, there'll be a lot of rain with it for North Carolina and Virginia all the way up through the mid Atlantic and southern New England again inches to our south. But a lot of Maine should be spared by raindrops. The exception would be right along the coast, especially the south coast. We could pick up a brief period of rain at some point late in the weekend or early next week. Marine forecast sees two to four feet. Northeast winds five to ten knots becoming southeasterly. Mostly sunny today, 70. Tomorrow clouds increase. Chance for a shower in the evening. Sunday, mostly cloudy. Chance for a shower again, especially south. And we'll keep that shower chance going on Monday. And then Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, we're getting really nice again as temperatures approach 70 with a lot, a lot of sunshine mm. for that second half of the week. And the sun always feels really good. Yeah, it this definitely does. It's not too strong. No. You know, you can sit in it and feel like it's warming your yes. body nicely. Which You're not you overheating. Want. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. No overheating. All right. Thanks, yep, Todd. Sure.